and you get that diagnosis, autism, it's like a mystery behind it. It's like, okay, well, what does that mean? He's autistic. Um, and you know, they're still developing, they're still doing research, so no one can really give you a definitive answer. So you're just left with this big question mark about, well, what is my child going to be? Is, is he going to be completely dependent? And is he ever going to be able to take care of himself? Is he going to be able to interact in the world? Am I going to have to keep him locked up in his room? Am I going to be able to go out and, you know, be able to call a babysitter to watch my child? And I'm able to go out and enjoy my life? There's just so much mystery shielded behind it, but I've noticed here at the Victory School, it's such a family community that they always, the opportunity is always there for you to, to give a definition to autism. Here was the, this was the first place that I got a definition. It's like, yes, Dylan's autistic. Yes, he has social issues. Yes, all these things, but we're gonna push him beyond that. And he's gonna be something, whatever it is. And that's what has moved me, is being able to look at my son and know that he's gonna be something, you know? And no matter what it is, he's gonna, he has, there's a light at the end of the tunnel. And the school has given me that, and I'm internally grateful, and my family's grateful, and every opportunity that we see a little light go on in Dylan, we promote it, we're positive about it because we know that it's going to lead to Dylan being the person that he's destined to be.